everyone. My name is Krishna Sai. So I we are going to prove the product rule. The product rule is the derivative of 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 f of x times g of x. Equals f the derivative of f of x times g of x plus f of x times the derivative of g of x. I am going to prove the product rule. Then the derivative of f of x is. Is is the limit as delta x approaches zero of f of x plus delta x minus f of x by delta x? We now will substitute f dash of x in the product rule. Which will equal the limit as delta x approaches zero of of f of x plus delta x times g of x plus delta x minus f of x. Times g of x by delta x. Add and subtract f of x plus delta x times g of x to 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 factor out f of x plus delta x here and g of x here. So equals the limit as delta x. Approach is zero of f of x plus delta x times g of x plus delta x x minus f of x plus delta x times G of x plus plus f of x plus delta x times g of x. Because we are adding and subtracting both terms. Terms and minus. Minus f of x, g of x, plus g of x by delta x. Equals now let's take out f of x plus delta x here and g of x here. Equals the limit. Delta x approaches zero of f of f of x plus delta x x times times g of x plus delta x minus G of x plus plus here both terms have g of x so g of x g of x times plus f times f of x plus delta x. Oops. Minus f of x 
by delta x and now let's split these two terms equals the limit as delta x approaches 0 of of f of a x plus the delta x times g of x plus delta x minus g of x by e delta x plus limit delta x approaches 0 of of a 0 of of g of x times f of x plus delta x minus f of x by delta x now let's take f of x plus delta x and g of x here and we know that delta x is very near to 0. So we can just write as f of x. So equals f of x times the limit as delta x approach 0 of, of, of f of g of x plus delta x. Minus G of X by Delta X plus so G of X times the limit as Delta X approaches zero of 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 G of f of x plus delta x minus f of x by delta x and when we when these two formulas are the same so this is the derivative of f of x and this is the same just different function notation so this is the derivative of g of x times f of x so g so we can write this term as the derivative of g of x so equals f of x times the derivative of g of x plus this can be just written as so the derivative of f of x times g of x so times the derivative of f of x times g of x. I can this and this both are the same.